Uh, hello everybody in this video I want to show you how to use a static uh, curl lib and start coding using Visual Studio okay just to uh, code network application using C or C++ uh, so the first thing so I have this guide here you'll find this guide in the descriptions below okay so the first thing, download uh, zip package from this link here. Okay. Uh, so when you download, uh, you will find. So when you download it, so that's my curl here. So of course you can download it from from the professional website of curl, but because every curl version has its properties its own properties so i want you to download this one here just to make it easy for you to understand this tutorial okay uh, so when you download when you finish download and zip uh, this file here uh, for me i want to put it in c disk okay okay So that's it. It's here now. Okay. Uh, the second thing. So open developer command prompt for Visual Studio. So let's open. So that's I have Visual Studio 2019. Even if you use 2017, that's the same thing. Okay. Uh, So that's the developer uh, command prompt for Visual Studio. Change the, the working directory by using CD. Okay. So what you want to do, you want to so we want to go to this folder. So this folder we build. Okay. So just copy this link here. Copy and return back here and and type cd and paste this link of this directory we build okay so now what you want to do just run n make f make file vc and mode static because i want to use this uh, this library statically okay uh, so let's copy this command and run it here paste it here and press enter so it's not it didn't excuse me so I want to Copy all this. So ran. Excuse me for this. Uh, ran. There is a problem here. I think. Where is the problem? Yes, here. So I changed something here. So copy. So copy this line here. So you will you will find this guide in the descriptions below. Okay. So run and make just and make. So copy uh, so n make f make file so that's mean that I want to make this okay to make the, I build this from this file here okay uh, 
So this may take some time, okay? Uh, so let's just wait something. So of course this for this for this link of the downloading link uh, uh, I mean so when you open so just click here downloading link to download this zip file okay So let's read this until it finished. So it finished now. Uh, so what I want to do now, after I and make this uh, this file here, so in project, so uh, of course I want to open a new project. So let's just create a new project and. Let's make it console app. So let's put it in the desktop. Uh, curl project. And create. So that's new. Uh, new project so of course in project property uh, VC++ directory uh, so what's that mean that mean I want to so of course when I when I build this uh, using this and make uh, this and make I will have this new folder here so this this new folder okay so i want to use this i want to use this include here okay so what's that mean what's that mean this line so that's mean that i want to go to the property uh properties so all configuration go here and include directory here what i want to add i want to add this path here okay the include path just copy and paste it here okay it's added here uh the second thing so in property in project property go vc++ directories uh, library directories and i add this folder here okay so what's that mean that mean i i go here so library directories and here what i add so i go in the same folder this uh, so let's just go here the first one here and I add this libraries here this library is directory I add it here okay so the third thing I go to project properties notice that here that's in the properties i must add this i i make this all configuration okay 
don't forget that it must be all configuration when you add this include uh, directory and the library directory also you must in the all configurations mode okay so now go to linker and input and in here so the, those are libraries all of these are libraries this library is separated by semicolon okay so now what we want to do you you want to add these libraries okay so let's add them one by one so i copy this first one and i add it here add i add this first one and I add also the second one and I separate it I separate them by this semicolon okay So they must be separated by semicolon. I have this one. And lastly, this one. Okay. So apply. And okay. So let's remove this program uh, so the last thing now in the program code code you want to add define curl static lib in the in the code topmost what's that mean that mean that in the first thing in your code you must define this this library statically okay? so that means that I want to add this code this this line here in the topmost of the code so let's use this example now uh, copy so let's try to run it now that's just a simple uh, program okay so that's running without any problem okay so and uh, so this program exited with the code zero that is that's me that there is no problem with this code okay uh, so that's it don't forget to add this line in the topmost okay so you will find this this guide in the descriptions below so i don't i i i think i can't i cannot write this code in the description because the youtube prevents me to write c code in the descriptions okay so that's just simple code add your code here okay so bec but before you add you add this your code you want to add this line define lib uh curl static lib in the topmost of your code so that's it i hope that, uh, that you like this video i i hope that you subscribe to my channel and see you soon